What's up world? Lee here with sticks, strings, and other things on this ninth day of Flossy Vlogmas. Welcome, welcome. I'm coming to you in the late afternoon. It's uh, the day, the day. <laughs> there's been day, day has happened. A couple of them have. But I'm here, I'm here, I will film. It is technically still daylight. Hopefully this will upload before the daylight is gone. That seems less likely, but we will see. Anyhow, hello. I hope your day and your December is going a little bit better than my last couple days. We have our tea today. Today's tea is Blossom, 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 Berry Pura. Blossom Berry Pura. It smells very flowery. This is the one that has some lavender in it and I'm not always a fan of the lavender. So we will see, we will see how it goes. Mm -mm. Nope. This is not a tea for me. We'll see if my partner cares for it. It, but it is not, it does not taste like Tussin, but it is, it is not a tea for me. Wah, wah. Oh, well. So shall we get into what did I actually get accomplished? Not very much. I'll let you in into a little secret, uh, not as much as I would have liked. First things first, let's look at the modern folk embroidery ever tote. Leon Roxy, mm -mm, Roxy Flosco collaboration and ta-da yeah no I didn't do all the red there's a whole bunch of little counting things right down here at the bottom that I did not do I, I couldn't I couldn't do that counting but I did the rest and I really loved this color this was sommelier I think was the name of the color I really liked it so we have some bits up in this motif here and obviously the one, the one on the other side and then here and here and then there were some random stitches here and a center bit here and I did not want to count to it so I didn't I will count to it for that color when I can and yeah that day was not the day I worked on this we will see when it is still really loving this finding it quite pretty so harsh up to date. Yeah, where does it go? I don't know. We'll put it there. We'll put it there. We'll put it there. What else did I work on? Well, my stripe a day socks from Woolens and Nosh. Yes, I did my stripe. Ta da! Look at that lovely blue that I got to put in. Oh, so pretty. And yes, 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 yes. Both socks. Both socks. I'm finding these really pretty. Going through all the greens, and now we're going through the blues. I, I, I'm assuming the next color will be another blue. I wonder what color we'll get to after the blues. Maybe a purple or a red or... Only time will tell. So yes, yay. Second one I'm up to date on. Good, good, good. Now let's get to my... Euphorbia Wrap by Amber O'Brien. And I didn't even wind up the skein. I didn't even wind up the little mini hank from the eighth. Here's the eighth. So no, I am behind, much like I said that I likely would be. I am in fact behind. It happens. And I am trying to take this this countdown, celestial countdown season. I'm trying to take it a little easier. I'm having some health things. So I'm just making sure to take it easy and not let stress get to me. <laughs> so, no, I didn't keep up. That's okay. Maybe, maybe over the weekend, even though I'm starting really late today, maybe over the weekend I will catch up and maybe I won't and both of those are okay. Either way, I'm going to enjoy filming every day and opening the things and seeing how far I can get. And I hope you all are along for the fun ride. 
speaking of fun rides, what do we get to open next? Day nine of Plum Deluxe. We have a happy little Santa right there. Oh, I forgot to mark. I got forgot to mark on my list that I did not care for Blossom Berry Pora. I still have not had a chance to drink the Stargazer Caramel Matcha Chai yet, but I will. I will. So this is for day nine. Which is mango apricot green. Green tea, honey bush tea, mango pieces, peaches, apple pieces, mango slash apricot essence, and calendula. Well, that sounds pretty good. And QR code, QR code. I'm ready. Mango apricot green tea. Engage your body and mind with this juicy blend of mango, apricot, and peach. The burst of fruity flavor will delight your senses and bring to mind the joy of making connections and contemplating new ideas. Nice. Contemplating new ideas. So tomorrow morning, I will contemplate new ideas. Mm, they did say that this one might be good as a latte. I do not think I would care for it even with milk. So. Wah, wah. Oh, well. Shall we open up all the other fun things? I think we should. Let's start with Roxy Flasco Evertote. Modern Folk Embroidery. I'm like, I did them out of a different order. I, oh, shall we see? So this is December 9. There is a word, which I do not know how to pronounce. Ishpre? Probably a very bad pronunciation. Anyway, it is a Dutch word literally meaning ice merriment. In today's video, I'll share some, share some happy winter memories with you. Jacob will also probably teach us how to pronounce it correctly. The photo above is from the Rijksmuseum, Museum, the Rijksmuseum, by an anonymous photographer in the 1930s. So there's our picture for the day of ice merriment because I cannot say That word, I will try to learn. And that is quite fun. They are, they are ski skating. Yes, they are. And, yes, okay, I can do that. I can do that. I can. I think I'm missing where all this one goes. Do, 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 do. Oh, I should probably show the color. It's called On Point. E-N, on point, like ballet. And it is a very light pinky color. Very lovely. Oh, 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 I see, I see, I see, I see. I'm seeing where it goes now. I had misseen some of it, and yay, I can do that. I can do all of that without too much terrible counting. Terrible counting, terrible, terrible counting. Next up. Apologies, I have things next to me and I'm having to lean and do things and I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best. This is day nine of Black Needle Society. It's a pouch of some kind. It's like a notions pouch or a, a small, um, project bag type thing. That's what it feels like. Because that is what it is. Aw. Let me get it all out of all the plastics. And we have a little bag 
and it is Charlie Brown, Charlie Brown's Christmas. I don't have to cover anything because it only goes to day nine, so I can just read. Charlie Brown Christmas Accessory Pouch. Traveling this December? Use uh, this adorable Peanuts themed accessory pouch to store all of your on-the-go stitching essentials such as extra needles, scissors, a threader, measuring square, etc. Or a Mill Hill kit might fit in here. Yeah, it's just a nice little tiny one and yep, let me get it nice and close so you can see Charlie Brown Christmas. Is sweet. Now we have day nine of McMullen Fiber Company. This is the book covers. If I can open it, that would be great. We have the Hound of the Baskervilles. Another peachy one, but this time this peachy has some greens in it and some pinks. Lovely, 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 lovely. And we have Cannon Hand Eyes, Victorian, not Victorian, no, Victorian, Victorian Gothic. We were doing purples. Oh yeah, that's a purpley purple. You're never gonna get the right color. We'll see. We'll see if that's anywhere close to the right color. It is a beautiful purple, though. The debating for this one, the debating of what it will become, I still have no clue. Now we have date nine of Hugh Loco. This is her oxide fade. This is also the one that is going into my Euphorbia wrap, which I am behind on. We will see. We will see. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So here is day nine. Look at those fun colors. Let me unspool it. Mm, those will be fun to put in. How far will we get? Who knows? Who knows? I have to at least get day eight wound. I'll probably wind both day eight and day nine at the same time. Then we have my Jimmy Bean. These ones are in order, so it's nice and easy to catch. Ooh, we have chocolates, it looks like. So. Ooh. Two little chocolates. Yum, yum, yum. I'll have to see if they have any information on them because there's there's nothing paper wise in here to let me know what kind they are anything about them so I will need to see if I have an allergy to them or not but everybody likes a good truffly chocolatey thing and now day nine of my Farmer's Daughter's Fiber Celestial Countdown box. And since it's an odd numbered day, we should get yarn today. Oh, we do. So day nine. And there is the lovely color for day nine to go into the Weasel's Way wrap. Pretty, 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 yay. So I have three mini skeins to wind up, a ton of knitting to do, a ton of, well not a ton, but some stitching to do, a ton of knitting to catch up on. And yeah, we'll see how much I can get done tonight while taking it easy um, to help with what's going on. And we will come back tomorrow. I should be able to film in the morning tomorrow. So this should go up early, though, trying to film in the morning tomorrow might also mean that uh, things may not get done. See how far I get. Come back on the 10th, the 10th, the 10th, tomorrow, this is the 10th. 
next month. This month is going kind of quick, don't you think? I think it is. All right, I am going to let you all go and I will see you all tomorrow. Hag Samayach. <laughs>